With the introduction of iOS 13, Apple have included a method that allows us to work with two applications at the same time. So in this video, we're going to take a look at how we can multitask on an Apple iPad. For this demonstration, we will be using an iPad Mini 4, as this model of iPad is one of the older models that iOS 13 can still be installed on too. The reason why we've chosen this model of iPad is that working with multitasking can be very frustrating, and for some reason feels more difficult to do on older models of iPad hardware. Before we start, there are a couple of things that we need to prepare in order to make working with multiple applications easier. First, we need to have the applications that we want to multitask with available in the dock. So for this demonstration, we've already pinned both pages and numbers to our dock. We're also going to change the orientation of our iPad so that both of our applications will have more space to work in. Let's get started by opening pages. In order to enable multitasking and have a second application appear beside pages, we need to display the dock. So if we swipe up roughly 10 centimeters from the bottom of our screen towards the center of our screen, our dock should appear. Now in one fluid movement, we need to press and swipe up on the numbers icon. However, if you do this motion incorrectly, you will see a quick menu similar to the one that you can see here. This is because our finger was pressed down on the numbers icon for too long. Let's try again, but this time we will hold our finger over the numbers icon for around half a second, and then in one fluid motion, drag the numbers icon into the center of our screen. As Numbers is currently a floating application, you should be able to see a handle. We can use this handle to move numbers around our screen. However, as we want to place numbers next to pages, if we drag numbers to the right side of our screen, numbers will automatically dock so that we're presented with the two applications side by side. Now that our screen has been split into two applications, you can see that we have three handles. We can use these handles to resize or move the two application windows around our screen. If we now swipe from the bottom up to the center of our screen, we will be returned to the home screen. Let's once again open pages. As you can see, because we returned to the home screen and then reopened pages, we are no longer in multitask mode. So let's reopen numbers and once again place both applications in split screen mode. Now let us try closing one of the two applications that we have on our screen. In order to close an application, we will need to perform a two step motion. First, we need to place our finger over one of the top handles. We then need to drag that application into the center of our screen. With our numbers application now floating over the pages application, we need to once again press and hold the handle on our instance of numbers. Then if we swipe to the right of the screen, we will close the numbers application. To demonstrate that numbers is now closed, let's once again change the orientation of our iPad back to portrait mode. Now if we view open apps, we can confirm that Numbers is currently not running on this iPad. 